growing up in a family business is, uh, it, it's interesting, but from early on, I was in the office all the time and, and talking about fabric all the time, which was always interesting. Um, but it's really exciting. My grandfather, start, my great-grandfather, uh, Jacob, started the business uh, in the early 1930s. And, uh, sure, you know, at some point later on, my grandfather and my grandfather's brother joined the business, as well as both of their, each of their sons joined the business. And then as time went on, uh, the business had changed. It went away from uh, women's sleepwear and, and lingerie to more of the quilt shop only business and chain business and fabric. And at that point, my dad was taking the reins more so than everyone else and he more or less told them either I take you guys over or you take me over and that's where we are now so my, my dad took them all over and now the business is just on our side of the family um, of course in between my grandfather he survived till about four or five years ago he was 94 coming into the office in a suit and tie uh, he was just a total gentleman everyone loved him and uh, he was always interested in what was going on in the business so he would come and walk around and talk to the, all the people and we'd have nice lunches together but it is very memorable and, and very special for me and um, and it was just really nice so right now we are it's now 2015 and my brother Greg just joined us uh, earlier uh, last year well in the middle of last year and he's 45 I'm 42 my dad is still under his seven uh, right around 70 not quite yet and my brother and I each have two boys so we're excited about the future and uh, hopefully we'll live long enough to see our boys join the business um, if you read one of my recent blogs uh, my son Aaron said to me I hope I work with you one day and, and I hope we could share an office so it's really special and for me, I have those same feelings towards my dad and grandfather since we all got to work together. It, it is special. Um, it's really nice that we all get along. You know, I know there are a lot of other family businesses where the people don't get along and everyone hates each other, but that is certainly not the case with us. So it, it really works out well. We get along great. You know, no one drives anyone too crazy. Um, you know, another thing that's nice is my dad and brother and I are all on the same train line. So we go home on the train together, we walk the train together, and we talk about what's going on, and, and we have lunch together every day and talk about what's going on. So it, we're just really a very tight-knit family. As far as my kids, I'm, I'm always on the websites, and my kids are always asking, and whenever I have business trips and I have my bags packed, I always take out the samples and I show them, and I bring them fabrics, and they play around. Um, and and it's always so cute because I always say sometimes people said and what do you want to do when you grow up and they'll say I want to sell fabric like daddy so it, it's just really sweet and you know we have all kinds of things made out of different fabrics in our house um, and even we've had some furniture that that's been covered with some of our fabric so a, a fabric is, is really part of our life our, our lives um, it, it is important to us we really love fabric and and it's it's a major part of our lives and and we're very thankful we've been very fortunate first off to be uh, lasting business this long with so many generations and we've been fortunately successful to continue so uh, I couldn't be happier I, I love working here um, I love being with my family I, I love the closeness that we have I enjoy the traveling and I love to be able to tell people that I am the fourth generation because not many people could say that so I can only imagine how it's gonna be for my kids when they say it's the fifth generation